now while Senate Republicans were grinding out their health care bill in secret, President Trump was also hard at work in public uh, at a big rally in Iowa, campaigning for the job he already has. But the real appeal for Trump <laughs> doing these rallies is to get back in front of his loyal crowds and to feed off their energy. And you know what was really impressive to see last night was how Trump supporters are so on board with their dude. He can say anything and they'll come along for the ride. I'll give you an idea that nobody has heard about yet. And we're thinking of something that's unique. We're talking about the southern border. Lots of sun, lots of heat. We're thinking about building the wall as a solar wall so it creates energy and pays for itself. And this way, Mexico will have to pay much less money. And that's good, right? Is that good? Wait, what? No, 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 hold on, I'm sorry, hold on, hold on. There are too many things going on here. I can't, let, let's just piece it, let's just piece it together, slowly, slowly. Okay, first of all, you realize those are Trump supporters. Trump supporters cheering massive government spending into solar panels. Solar panels <laughs> that will save a ton of money for Mexico. <laughs> He's like, it'll save money for Mexico, huh? Huh, am I right? Yeah, and the people are like, yeah, I guess so, I guess the... I feel like the only way that could have gotten more ridiculous is if at the end of that, Trump said, we'll save Mexico money. Everyone says, "Allo, Akbar, death to America, folks. <laughs> I'm with Hillary. I'm with her. Woo! <laughs> like, what, what are they cheering for? This is the guy who spent the entire campaign revving up crowds by dissing Mexico and praising the nutritional benefits of coal. And now he's flipping? <laughs> It feels like Trump's crowd's only consistent belief is that if Trump said it, it's good. And by the way, let's just, let's just talk about this quick. How does a solar wall work? Let's think about this, how does it work? Because <laughs> solar panels need to face up. Now you're saying the wall, <laughs> just logically, the wall is like this, the sun is, and then where's the sun? <laughs> where's the sun going? How does this, how is it even gonna work? It doesn't, the only way, the only way you could make this work is if the solar panel was tilted like a solar, like properly, the wall would need to be like this so that you could get the sun, but now you've just created a ramp for Mexicans to ride into America. <laughs> this is flying into the country. <laughs> just like Latino evil Knievels, like what are you doing? <laughs> this doesn't make sense. All the most important promises of Trump's campaign, all that populism, that's what got him elected. He can just reverse any part of it, and everyone is good with it. Like, for instance, remember this? When you cast that ballot, just picture a Wall Street boardroom filled with the special interests who have been bleeding your country and your city and every place else, and imagine the look on their faces when you tell them you're fired. <laughs> fired. Okay, cool. So, Wall Street bad, right? We're all on the same page. No, apparently we're not. We have the legendary Wall Street genius Wilbur Ross here. He's our Secretary of Commerce. We have Gary Cohn, who is the president of Goldman Sachs. And Wilbur's a very rich person in charge of commerce. I said, because that's the kind of thinking we want. When you get the president, this is the president of Goldman Sachs, smart. Having him represent us. And I love all people, rich or poor, but in those particular positions, I just don't want a poor person. Does that make sense? Does that make sense? Yeah. When there's a federal department of dip I'll hire one of you guys. I'll hire one of you. Yay, Trump, yay! Who is this guy? <laughs> like, like, what world is this? Donald Trump just said, we need bankers to run this country, and everyone applauded. Right now, I'm just thinking, Poor Hillary Clinton. <laughs> bankers, Goldman Sachs bankers. That's what everyone went after her for, and now Trump, they're like, yeah! I just imagine at this point, every object in Hillary's house is just bent in rage. <laughs> Everything. <laughs> Everything is just bent. The, the spoons, the forks, uh, Bill, everyone just bent over like, yeah! 